Hi guys, Grace here. I hope you had an awesome, productive, wonderful, joyous day and you were able to help people with your business, whatever that may be. Um, I'm really strongly encouraging you to listen to this whole video. This is the best marketing advice that anyone can ever give you and it's very, very, very simple. Um, most marketers don't want to share this kind of thing with you because um, it will allow you to rely on them less, get more for your money, and grow your business a whole lot quicker. I know it sounds too good to be true, and I'm not one of these hype people. I don't, <laughs> you know, um, I don't hype things up very much. I don't do big announcements. I share useful nuggets of information that can be applied right now to grow your business, and this is a big one. So, listen carefully. When you create content for your marketing, that can be a social media post with a graphic. It could be a video interview that you do. It can be um, any piece of information. It can be a blog that you write. I want you to think of the word leverage. How much leverage can you get from your content. My writer and I were talking today and she was interviewing me for a piece that she's writing. And I told her, I go, this isn't just going to go on our website. This is going to go to this group. This is going to go to that group. We're going to repurpose. I use the word repurpose a lot. We're going to repurpose this for the blog, for the social media accounts. Um, we're going to make it into a video. We're going to add content to that video, link it back to the website. We're going to repurpose this for SEO. So every little thing that you do, you want to think about how do I leverage this just a little bit further? And when you've got really great systems for mileage, you can do a lot more with a lot less. So it requires less of that constant thinking of what else can I do? What should I do next? And I'm not saying you just have three sentences and then you post those three sentences on all of your social media platforms. I'm not saying that. Your content has to be good. It has to bring value. It has to get people interested, engaged, intrigued, um, and, and you want to get to them to the point where they know more about you. But listen, people don't follow everything everywhere. Some people are blog readers and they will sign up for your blog. Other people will actually open an email marketing campaign. Others want to see something in print, hard copy. Others will take that information that they see on social media and they'll click follow and they'll read all your stuff. Some people like getting their information on Instagram. Other people like getting their information on YouTube. So how are you going to create a marketing program that is not super reliant on you to do all of the tasks involved with getting mileage out of your content, but involves you just enough to represent your brand in a way where it's true to you, it's genuine to who you are and what you do to provide value, but then it just goes. It grows wings, it flies away, and it continues to contribute to your business. So I'm going to challenge you today to think about that word leverage or mileage how are you going to take what you do, maybe the things you already do on a daily basis, like those conversations you have with patients that seem so automatic and natural to you, how are you going to take those natural conversations and turn them into golden marketing nuggets that we can then repurpose, reuse, and leverage? All right, guys, I hope this is helpful. And if you have any questions about how to create your own marketing program or how to build a brand that's unique to you, you know how to reach me. Thanks, guys.